Hey everybody, welcome back to another episode on the Hermitcraft server. I hope you guys are all doing good. I'm having a fantastic day myself. Today, guys, we're doing something a little bit different. I want to finish up my armor today, but the problem is, is that there is no mending books on this server whatsoever. Um, trying to find mending books on the server is like pulling teeth. It's really, they're really, really hard to find. So, to solve that issue... I've come up with an idea. Mumbo has a lot of villagers and he has a mending villager for I think it's either 26 or 28 emeralds and a book. So my game plan is to find a villager somewhere on the server that I can use to trade iron with because iron is the most abundant thing on the server. We'll go to the shop district, we'll buy a jillion pieces of blocks and then we'll go and find a villager to trade with emeralds. I need seven books of uh, mending. That equals out to about three stacks. So I need three stacks of emeralds to make this work. Uh, so hopefully, hopefully I can get this to work. But it's going to take me a long time to do it because I've got to go get the iron. Then I've got to go to find a villager that will work. So uh, once I get all that kind of set up and I find a villager I can trade with, I will come back to you guys. Okay, guys, so I'm over at Mumbo's base. Hopefully he doesn't mind me using his villagers, but uh, I've been trading. And as you can see, I've already gotten 35 diamonds. I've been trading with this first guy right here. He's got a trade seven iron uh, for pretty much what we need. Uh, I do need to find another trade that's cheap so I can trade with him. I don't I, mean, I want to make sure that all his trades are unlocked when I leave, obviously. Um, so I can, you know, I don't want to spend, you know, seven diamonds or seven on these on a shovel. That kind of, that is like counter progress. You know what I'm saying? I might do that one just to unlock it. I've got a little bit of spare diamonds, but that should unlock the, uh, all of his trades again. Yeah. So I'm going to keep trading. Like I said, it wasn't that bad to get 36 already. And I went and got my iron. Um, we should be able to get three stacks pretty quickly. Uh, I'm sure there's other trades here as well that I could probably use. Looks like Mumbo's been trading with uh, pumpkins, which is pretty kind of cool. Um, I'm just I'm just trying to get enough to where I can uh, use this 24 mending right here. Oh, no, this one's 14. I didn't even see that one. Wow, that's a good book then. Where is it? Right there. Aqua Affinity mending. So, yeah, we're definitely going for that one then. Um, we initially needed three stacks, but 14 times 7 is 98 divided by 64. We only need a stack and a half if we go with that one. So that's pretty exciting. So we're almost pretty much already there then. Um, let's keep, I mean, we might as well just keep trading now. And then, uh, sometimes it, um, <clears throat> excuse me, sometimes it pretty much unlocks itself, I think. Yeah, sometimes it does lock back, though. Does he have a gold trade? No. Unfortunately, I don't... I mean, I I, uh, I might do the three diamond trade again. Does he have another... Okay. I'll probably do this one, like, one more time to try to unlock that. Nothing? Did he not unlock? No, he did not unlock. Wow, okay. What does this guy have? This guy has nine iron... And then you. I will definitely make sure to unlock that other guy when we. Uh... Okay, so he should be unlocked again. It's super easy to get emeralds like this, by the way. <coughs> Excuse me. But I'll say I wasn't sure if he was going to unlock himself again. So we needed about a stack and a half of iron. There we go. And then let me break that down as well. Oh, that was fast. Is he gonna... I'm not sure if he's gonna unlock again or not. Uh, looks like it. You. Okay, so we're already almost to a stack and a half here. Okay, so is he gonna unlock again? Yes, lucky! Okay. You... You. Okay. 
Am I gonna get lucky again? I'm not gonna get lucky again. Alright, just for the meantime, does he have another... He does not, okay. Alright, so what I might do is I might try to unlock his trades with the three diamonds again. See if that'll... There we go. Okay. Hopefully he unlocks again. Fantastic. Now I know I can shift click. I'm not actually a huge fan of the whole shift clicking thing. Sometimes it gives you like a misdirection of what you're actually uh, getting. Okay, so he locked again, didn't he? Does he have a cheaper trade? What is that? Oh, wow, that's a good. That's only five. Okay, I'll do that then. Okay, that should unlock it. No, okay. Try that. Let's say that was two different trades. <laughs> Better with unlock, damn it. Okay. Let's see if he unlocks again after that trade. Fantastic, okay. Yo. Talk about emeralds for days, yo. That might be enough right there. Alright, so we've got uh, 14 mending. Does he have any cheaper ones? Uh, 22. No, let's go to the 14 mending. Which was right here. The very end. So you, you, one, two. Gonna make me work for it, isn't he? <laughs> oh no, he unlocked a name tag. That's cool. Three, four, five, six, seven. Hopefully he unlocks again. There we go. Alright, so we now have the seven mending books that I need. So one will go on the axe, one will go on the shovel. Uh, three for the inventory and then one for the bow. Uh, so that went pretty successfully, actually. I thought that would take a little bit longer than what it did, but awesome. Uh, I'm going to go over and start purchasing enchantments for my armor. I'm not going to record that because we did that last episode. Uh, I'll meet you guys at the end to do a bit of enchant. All right, guys, I got to be honest with you. You don't miss your eye and your armor until it's gone. And I miss my armor. <laughs> it has taken so much work to get back to this point uh to where we're about to be and i'm not even sure that i have all the enchantments that i need just yet uh I'm trying to just make a little space here there we go um okay so the first thing we got to do here get all this off my bar i want to throw that away that away that away that away Okay, <clears throat> so first things first, let's go to our shocker box here. We need to make our our axe uh, efficiency th or unbreaking three. So unbreaking three, mending. Okay, axe is finished, and then let's go to the shovel. The shovel needed unbreaking three and mending as well. So, unbreaking three, mending. All right, so now we need more XP. I'm having like this weird glitch where I'm not hitting all of the Endermen at once or something. It's weird. I've never seen that happen before. I've always just naturally hit them. There we go. Okay, so now that that's finished, I can put some of this stuff up here. Get some of this out of the way. I'm trying to clean my inventory up a little bit. It's a disaster area, man. Okay, get that out of the way. Oh, okay. Next up is uh, we're going to start on our enchantments for our armor. So we have a bunch of enchantments to do for the armor. Let me grab a little bit more. 
Okay, there we go. Seems like you have to be like relatively close to for it to do that or something. It's like I've never seen that happen before. Anyways, helmet. Uh, mending. And then we want that has fire, respect, fortune, unbreaking. Alright, let's go unbreaking two. Unbreaking three. Protection four. And so we need respiration. I feel like I'm missing a helmet enchant. I forget. Was there another helmet enchant? Oh, aqua affinity. I knew I forgot something. Um, I think what aqua affinity lets you see underwater better, right? All right, well, we can add that back in when we get to the base. That's not a big deal. Grab some more SP. Okay, so you and you I need 21 levels for that. I'm not sure I'm going to have enough XP. All right. Come on. It's like not doing splash damage. It's weird. Okay. So I need aqua affinity for that helmet and then it'll be good to go. Put you in there. I need to get rid of these ender pearls really quickly. I wish it was like some sort of trash can here. There we go. Can I hit these guys with my hand? Doesn't really work that good. Okay, there we go. Next up, let's work on the leggings. So we've got unbreaking and then protection three. Protection three. All right, so mending, unbreaking two. Unbreaking three, so that's ten levels. There we go. I right, get more more XP from that. There we go. Protection three. We need nineteen levels for protection four. Oh, so now my sword wants to work the correct way. Makes complete sense, yeah. So that should give us 19 levels. There we go. So mending, protection, unbreaking. There we go. Go over here. Next up is our boots. Now, the boots are missing an enchantment. It'll be Mending, Feather Falling, Depth Strider, and then Protection. What is that missing? Oh, it's missing um, Unbreaking. I couldn't get another Unbreaking book. I didn't have enough uh, Emeralds. I needed like 10 more or something like that. All right, and I couldn't find any unbreaking books in the um, in the uh, thing. Okay, so let's go ahead and start these. So mending, feather falling, depth strider, and then I'm not gonna have enough, and I'm gonna need probably about another 17 levels. Okay. That. So there is protection three. And then we need 19 levels for that. No way I didn't have 19 levels there. Okay. Oh, 
Come on, 19 levels. Uh, oh my god, are you serious? Hater. There we go. You. You. Boom. Alright, so our new diamond armor is finished. We can take that off. Put that up there. Uh, mending and breaking. So we have one more enchant to do here. Uh, and that's the bow. The bow needs mending, infinity, and punch two. And we'll be good to go. So you, 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 you. All right, so we finally, after all this time, uh, we're only missing, like, literally, like, two enchantments. We're missing, um, so let's see, that's good. We need Unbreaking 3 on the bow, and we need Unbreaking 3 on the boots. Those are the only two enchants we are missing. So, Mending, Unbreaking, Mending Protection, and we are oh, actually missing Aqua Affinity, Unbreaking, and then unbreaking. So we're, uh, those are pretty close to being completely perfect enchantments for what we want. All right, guys. So now, um, a couple things I want to do here. First off, starting thing in. <laughs> I have been just avoiding this for like ever. Need to just fill that in real quick. Uh, I want to work on the pathway out here. Kind of get a final idea for what I want to do. Um, so my idea was initially to run the fences back along the inside, just like this. And that's not a bad idea, but I have another idea that I do want to try. And it may not be good for like a section like this, but it would be kind of perfect for something like right here. I had considered putting fences on the outside like so. And then just doing these like that. Uh, actually, I kind of hate that now that I look at it. Okay, you know what? No, I don't want to do that. I'm going to do it the other way, I think. At least we have a solid idea of what we want to do. Okay. Try to fly again here. Ooh. It's nice that my uh, arrows aren't shooting correctly. <laughs> uh, it's so glitched out sometimes. Okay, anyways. As long as we can get back up here, we'll be okay. So I don't think we're going to do it like that. I think we are going to do it like the way we had it. So that just makes it like that. The one reason why I wasn't sure if I wanted to do it like that or not was because. Um, let's see, something like that is pretty bad. Let me go grab a piece of stone brick because something like that we can just simply fill in. and It'll be OK. May look a little off, but I have a piece of stone brick anywhere. Like, there we go. Now, and then make it too high. Maybe I should. Uh... See, I can't put it on that side because that side has to connect to that. So some of these. Uh, we'll sort of have to be kind of filled in a little bit. Didn't exactly want to have it. I didn't really have it planned to be like that. And then this one's like the same thing almost. Maybe we should just, uh, in certain spots, just fill this in like this. I don't think that's going to be too big of a fuss. Some of it is it's just because of the angles. It makes it all weird looking. 
But to be honest with you, I think once we get it all finished, it'll be okay. I don't think it's going to be too big of a worry. Okay. So something like that, I'm thinking. But we are out of time for recording today. Now that we're done um, with the enchanting stuff, we can finally get back to building and working on the base. Thank God. I want to clean this area up. I got to get all my items downstairs and things like that. Um, but anyways, if you guys enjoyed this episode, make sure you hit that like button. Otherwise, I hope you guys all have a great day. This is Hi Jevin. Peace out, everybody.